Meow. 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 <coughs> Alright, we're good. Hello, people. This is Tubers Game Now. I'm your host, Stringer Bro. I am your other host, Older Bro. And we're back playing some Holler Night where I don't know what Older Bro's doing today. Probably fighting a boss and taking the whole stream. That. Well, maybe not the whole stream, but that's the plan. <clears throat> so, what other bosses can you do over Trunk? None. If you're none. What part of like I've said three times now that I am done over charming after, after this point. Nothing left will be over charmed. Okay. <clears throat> um The only thing I might consider trying to overcharm is a few of the uh fights in the uh uh in the final area. <clears throat> the um what are they called? The uh, Pantheon. But that I'm not even certain I'll do. Not committing to it. Yeah, I'm not committing to that. And I'm explicitly not. I'm explicitly refusing the other fights. Okay. So, uh, <clears throat> some interesting news. I have told you about the next Pirates movie, right? No. No? Okay. So, uh, there is a trailer going around showcasing the next Pirates movie, in quotes. Okay. It's true, but it's not true. <clears throat> what there is, mean? there is a legit film coming. Yeah. Uh, and the trailer just dropped for it. But it's a fan-made movie. So there is going to be a Pirates of the Caribbean movie that is fan made and it is legit coming out. That's fucking weird. Yeah. What the? Hold on. How in the goddamn hell did I take double hits that time, but none of the other times? <clears throat> so, whoever they got to cast as Jack Sparrow nailed it he, yeah. he's amazing but yeah that's gonna be an interesting movie uh, it's on our list for hot takes but it's I don't know how we're gonna view it I have no idea if it's coming to theaters or if it's coming to a YouTube channel I got... I'll be very honest I do not consider a movie to be a movie unless it's in theaters so if it's like I don't give a shit that like even if a prominent youtuber does it that's not a movie I'm, I'm just gonna die here so uh, like it's hot takes must be in theaters so if it doesn't come to theaters it's not a hot take would it count as a retro hard no, take? No, it doesn't count as anything. Right. It like let me say it this way: <clears throat> I will like I love has been hotel. We will never do a watch through for has been hotel or a uh, hell of a boss. Hey butter, hello butter. Ever like I'm what I'm gonna say it this way: uh, there are a lot of YouTubers that are very good at what they do. You are not a mo you didn't you are not a movie maker until you make a movie. Hey Croc. So I will not ever do any review of content on this channel that does not come from a license unless it comes from a licensed uh Hollywood studio. So it must come out as a movie or release on TV as a TV show. YouTube is not, I don't consider that to ever be, not only canon, I don't consider that to be a release. Okay. So, it's like, so, <clears throat> will not ever. So, no. It's, it is not a Pirates of the Caribbean movie unless it comes out in theaters. Um, by the way, guys, as another uh, note for today... It's younger sis's birthday, so make sure to tell her happy birthday on the Discord or oh my God, what wherever. Is 
Yep, younger sis is no longer a teenager. Good for her. And you better believe I'm, she's gonna spend money on Fortnite. I'm 90% sure that I did, in fact, beat this at least once. I have no fucking idea how that's possible. Like, actually, seriously, I don't know how this is possible. You don't know how you can no. you this like, game I, no. <laughs> no, 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 I don't have to do this. I can just not do this. Let me make that very clear. I don't understand how this guy is killable by anyone. Like, what I'm saying is I don't understand how people kill this boss. <clears throat> because he doesn't take damage. Do you think if you got the nail upgrade no. it would help? I mean, the nail upgrade would technically help in the sense that it would cause me to slightly faster knock him into actual damage phases. Oh yeah, did you get sleep crack? It's just the fact you get no soul from this boss. And because you don't get soul from him, if you're doing soul fight rounds, you cannot fight him. Like... Would you fucking Jesus jump? Christ. Like, like, this boss just sucks. I don't want to spend 30 minutes fighting him. Just fucking move on. You think I can't sleep? <laughs> Question mark. <laughs> Croc, I thought you said you were. I thought you said you had good news, <laughs> not bad news. Ah, uh, that that was good. Like crack. I want to just, just the next good. time I have to redo this fight. Just count how many times it takes me to hit him before he actually can take damage. Why are you swinging three times? I think I only sold Fucking hell. actual damage once. <laughs> yes, I, that's not a joke. I have only dealt him damage once. Ever. Is getting renovated. Does that mean it's getting remodeled? That's what the word renovated means, younger bro. It means remodeled. <clears throat> But yeah, no, seriously, actually count this. That's not a joke. Please count this for me. You're at one. Yep. <laughs> that I'm aware of. <coughs> Ow. Yeah, you want to be close, but not too close. Yeah, but you can't damage him without being close. Like, that's <clears throat> the problem. There is no way to damage this boss without sword attacking him at all like he doesn't give you soul uh, ex the only reason i'm getting souls because i have my charm on that gives me soul from taking damage yeah the only time i hear the word renovate is when somebody's like moving into a new house that's not no <laughs> like five hits Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I like how I started having good grades in English. <laughs> good but, grades in English. It's why did he? Why did he not move? But just because I got good grades in English doesn't, doesn't mean, mean you know what words mean. That I know what all words mean. You're just taking it. Yes, I <laughs> want to count. I lost count, and I think I was over 30 hits. That This is what I'm saying. How do you fight this boss? How can this boss be fought? Like, if I'm hitting him 30 fucking times, and he's taking no... He's not moving. How the fuck can you fight this guy? I understand that I'm not using a... Like, a, a, like, I'm using a soul build, but, like, fucking hell. He should not take over 30 hits before he even ta can start taking damage. Unfortunately, I think... Like, fucking hell. I think that boss is a nail build. Yes, and that's what I'm saying. Like, that, no, no boss in this game works this way. None. I think he's... The this only is the one. only boss in the game that actively says... No, you you can't nail. use soul. And it's like, I 
hate this boss because it is so antithetical to the rest of the bosses in this game. It's like, fucking hell. I wish there was like a free revive charm. So it's like, I guess, okay, I guess what I need to do is I need high blood. I need to restore his hits. I guess I can try this. Problem is, I think he just deals too much damage, even with high blood. <clears throat> yeah, it's like, I can try this. But it's like, holy crap, what the heck? Because, like, again, soul is, like, worthless here. Yeah, there is no soul power with this boss. Yeah, it's like, what the hell? Oh, right, I don't have my... There's two of these guys? I didn't even know there were two. So I now have I now have increased strength, increased range, and I restore health from hits. So hopefully that means I can at least go into this fight and like last a while. But yeah, like this that's why I'm saying I might have to wait to do this boss literally last and get all the nail upgrades and just try to kill him. He literally throws sound waves at you. Well, not quite, but... I know. mean, it looks like Ow. it. <clears throat> I only... Like, me personally, I only send extra Pokemon to home if I have extras of them. Otherwise... Even if it's a shiny I do not have in, like, Scarlet and Violet, I will still keep it in Pokemon Go because I need it for Pokemon Go. So, I don't know. It, it, it's up to you. Oh. Like, if you don't want to do what I do and just keep some of the shinies for Pokemon Go and you want to complete your shiny decks. Pretty sure that was over 30 damage. Then I'd say it's fine to transfer them. What the? Come on, game. Fuck you. Dude. I literally got hit by his body and took damage. Like, fucking hell. So what you're Worthless saying shit. is you got bodied? Your jokes aren't funny, and they're in <laughs> and they're inappropriately timed. Are uh, you send any shiny? I'd say if you're sending every shiny, no matter what, to home, then oh right, I forgot you can hit him with his own orbs. Then I that guess sucks, you can. But trade your extra shinies you. for something that you need. Just fuck off, game. Dude. I, I, okay, I need to actually see if there's a setting to turn off the damn hit effect. Like if, if I can turn that off, I'd really appreciate it. I don't think there is. God damn it. Really wish there was a way to turn off the damn hit. I keep getting... I keep not being able to see shit because the effect of being hit 
takes so much of the screen up that I literally can't see anything. Yeah, that black it's, border. Like, it's... I, I get it. I know why it's there, and I appreciate it sometimes. But most of the time, I just want it to go the fuck away. Yeah, I'm not sure if there's been any game that I've ever played that gets rid of an effect like that. Yeah. I think the closest is Pokemon, where you can turn off the battle, like, animation. No. But... I dashed, asshole gang. I'm honestly lost what just happened there. Yeah, I think you've hit this face twice now. Jump over. Fuck you. Again, I have never, by my sword, ever knocked him into the into hell. Ever. This boss cannot be killed without nail upgrades. He is impossible. That is fucking impossible. Just fuck this boss. Just fuck this shitty boss. As a reminder, you fight this boss with no soul. Like, this boss is nail only when you fight him. And it is not this arduous. And that's the problem. The boss isn't hard. It's arduous. It's a pain in the ass and nothing else. Like, every other boss in this game is fun to fight. <clears throat> this boss is not fun to fight. It just wastes your time. Like, it is not fun to fight a 25-minute boss fight that is 95% sword swipes. This boss sucks. So on that note, fuck all these charms. <laughs> okay. Okay. With I this boss dead, because I'm not fighting him, we're going downstairs. Yeah, I think Older Bro's more annoyed than actually pissed off. Yeah. Because he Just, didn't want to do the nail upgrades until... Yeah, it's I really don't want to do nail upgrades. <clears throat> and so it's like, this boss is one of the only bosses you can't do without nail upgrades. And I'm sure... But there is a speedrunner out there who can. And if by speed and by speedrunner I mean somebody who spends 50 minutes fighting this boss. Where the hell am I going? Someone who is not older bro can do it. Yeah, somebody who isn't me can do this boss. Fuck this boss. <clears throat> yeah, I'm sure there's people out there that beat SpongeBob the game. Pretty much every game, if a game exists, there's speedrunners of it, so, yep. But, fuck that boss. Oh yeah, I forgot, there's a shortcut in here now. Wait, hold on. Uh, no, wait, this is a, this is a drink fight, it's fine. Wake up. <clears throat> I love this effect. Like, I love that you walk in here, and you can see in the background the five champions. I think, well, actually, the middle one's the king, so he's not a champion, but... This time he's covered in bird poo. Fuck you. This boss is just a lot. 
and I am not fighting him optimally. Oh, went the wrong way. Yeah, I, I was kind of annoyed at work today. <clears throat> not that we, you know, didn't get off early. Fuck up. Um, but, uh... That was a terrible fight, because I fought him terribly. So, I have an app from my work, and I'm supposed to do, like, questionnaires on it. Yep. Well, I mean, I don't have to, but I do. Yeah. Um, well, I can't do them unless I clocked in. Yes. I was... I assumed I was clocked in with my second lunch. I usually don't clock out my second lunch because yep. it's paid lunch. And I go into the app and it was giving me the error that you're not clocked in. I'm like, okay. So I go clock in, I think. Yeah. And it still does it. And I'm like, oh, shit. So... Yeah, guys, I have no idea how much I got paid today because I didn't know if I was plugged in or out. Don't you have a way to check your timing? No. Your time? You should... I'm pretty sure they have to. There has to be a website that you can check because even I have one. It's like, I'm pretty sure they have to show you that. Like, just for legal reasons, they have to, there has to be some way for you to know. It, it concerned me that on the next batch seat, I wasn't there. And I go to my supervisor, I'm like, um, I'm not on the batch seat and I had some issues earlier uh, regarding clocking in and out. And he's like, oh, that's probably not because of clocked in and out situations. It's that I forgot your name. I'm like, oh. <laughs> could be either. I mean, it could be both. Yeah, so he forgot about me. So I just took over one of my friend's lines. Yeah, yeah. But seriously, though, I, I would definitely check that. I don't know how to. <laughs> like, well, I would ask somebody who's been there a while. There is definitely a way. Because that that's normally how uh, that's normally how you're supposed to like take time off. Like, is you have to go through those websites mm -hmm. or like whatever they, however you track your time. I should okay. not have gotten out of that. But yeah, so God damn it. I my... keep trying to use this to, to block his uh uh effort. Yeah, so my day at work was very annoying. Well, especially once I realized that uh, you can, your energy uh, blocks, I didn't realize that I didn't have any energy. <laughs> that your energy uh, destroys these. It's very helpful. Knew it. He actually got the face too. That I did. Ow. I was. No. I had no health. I needed to heal. The fact that there's no warp or no bench anywhere near here is kind of annoying. It means I can't trial new uh, soul, new charm options. That honestly, that's one of the things that I kind of wish you could do is change out, uh, change out uh, charms whenever. Like not within like boss fights, but like in any other situation. It's just like warrior explorer. Yeah, it's like. I I'm trying out new ways to fight the boss. I don't want to walk back to a fucking bench. Just wasting my damn time. And 
dash. Oh, that's actually kind of a good plan. Um, maybe when he's in a ball mode and he's bouncing around, maybe you should try to shriek him. That's what I'm going to do. Also, right there. That, that wasn't my plan there. <laughs> Ow. Oh, by the way. So, in watching all of the, the Dragon Ball yeah. intros for, you know, all the games, yep. I discovered that there was, at one point, an actual Dragon Ball Online game. You know, it was called Dragon Ball Online. Yeah. Huh. I called one of my Dragon Ball fan fictions Dragon Ball. That's a problem. Yeah. No, screwed that up. So I was writing a fan fiction of Dragon Ball Online without yeah. knowing it. I would uh, change the name of that for many reasons. Well, I don't have it now. Yeah, but. Um. Okay. And I can't call it like Dragon Ball Online 2 because people will think no. Yeah, you just can't use the word Dragon Ball Online. In the title, I should say. I could do Dragon Ball Super Online, I guess. No, that would be some fun. If I had still be the sequel. The, this only hits him once, so it's actually good. It's fine, Croc. This also is kind of good. I actually have three times. Shit. Okay. I'm getting there. I'm learning stuff. This one I have beat, so I know I can beat the White Defender. Not overcharged, but I can definitely beat him. Although, honestly, I might be able to beat him overcharged. Yeah, as far as we're aware, Dragon Ball does not have a VR game, and people are speculating that during Dragon Ball Battle Hour, they might reveal one. Let's see. <clears throat> Yeah, Croc, I have like 20 different quests that I can't complete because a lot of them require me to leave the house. Yeah, I can see that too. That could be a problem. Ow. Ow. Yes, it does, and I do know about it. I think it's on PC. I think the demo had you transform to Super Saiyan 4 and maybe Super Saiyan God. Ooh, that might be interesting for Kakarot to do. Um, maybe Kakarot should do a GT, uh, DLC. Yeah, sure. <clears throat> like, they're doing Dragon Ball right now. Yeah. Uh, it's gonna be for TN's tournament and Piccolo's tournament. Yeah, yeah. Ow. 
trick just works, so it's all good. Yep. Got him. You actually got him! <laughs> With one health left. Yep. Yeah. Dabba dabba. Yeah. His friends. <coughs> the other three, uh... Is this supposed to be George of the Jungle? No. This is supposed to be the, uh... This, this is the greatest knight in the entirety of the Kingdom of Hollow Nest. The Dung Defender. My friends, I will pro Wait. Did, did we have a voice for the no. Dung Defender? My friends, I will protect our dear kingdom. Have faith in me. We will all meet again. I promise it. Yeah, he's not dead. Well, this yeah. guy actually does not die. Ever. And I think you can infinitely refight him. Yeah. You can infinitely refight him. So, like, he does not die. He just is the white defender. The greatest knight. There he is. Well, hey, you defeated him. Figure from a fondly remembered past. Reacts gallantly to defeat by becoming stronger. The champions call the Knotted Grove the Battle of the Black Worm. I remember it all. I will carry those glories with me until we meet again. O Grim of the Five Knights. Yeah. The White Defender is like actually real. Is actually a really good fighter. Like he looks stupid. He is not stupid. Uh. Okay. I think I only need. I think we found we only need twenty four hundred. In which case, we should have enough right now to go get the final thing. Which, thank God. Out of my way! Um. Just barely. Yes, do you think you'll beat Nightmare uh, Grim? Un overturned or overturned? No. 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 Nightmare King Grim is just an insane fight. I think I might have a better chance of beating Nightmare King Grim than that fucking uh, nailless fight. Uh, but. Um, no. will, will you attempt him again after you get the nail upgrade? Hey. Yeah, I'll, I'll try him with full nail. But it's just like, holy shit. Please tell me it's not 2700, because I really don't want to have to get 2700. <clears throat> yeah, here we go. So much essence you brought. You truly are the wielder my tribe so long has dreamed of. The folk of my tribe were born from a light. <coughs> that light is the light side of the force. No. Similar to essence, similar to the powerful blade. Though much brighter still. They were content to bask in the light and honored it for a time. Yeah, they are born <laughs> from Radiance. <coughs> like, oh. Radiance was, the go was their god. But another light appeared in our world. A worm that took the form of a king. <coughs> How fickle my ancestors must have been. They forsook the light that spawned them. <laughs> Turned their backs to it. Forgot it even. And so this kingdom was born from the betrayal. But the memories of the ancient light still lingered. Hush whispers of faith until all of the... <laughs> <coughs> Hollowness began to dream of the forgotten light. And... Ah, but what's done is done, and so am I. The wielder has at last appeared, and I've held the memories of my tribe for long enough. It is time for us to be forgotten, too. Don't remember us, wielder. Don't honor us. We do not deserve it. I am sorry, Light Radius. I will remember you. Ascension. I'm Radiance now! 103. Yeah, that's the thing, is that bu all bugs came from Radiance, but the worm showed up as the king of Hollow Nest. And, um, 
led everyone astray. So, we are technically the terrible people. Okay. Um, where the hell am I going to go from here? Well, is there only two fights left? Basically. So, nail upgrade. See ya, Croc. <laughs> Have a good evening. Give me my phone. Okay. <sighs> okay, let me just confirm. I have to see what what is the what is all in 112 percent. Hey, can almost touch him. soul right now 2400 essence is a percent she's giving you your the pantheons your are a percent <clears throat> she's giving you her blessing to to date a uh, caterpillar girl <laughs> oh, i need i need the full, the actual condition guy this one up. this still is not good there was a nice list that Hollow Knight checklist, I think, is it? <clears throat> no, this is not it either. Okay, actually, I mean, I can use this. I think most of the percentage at this point is the charms. Did you have a return? Or not the charms. Um, Fights. Here. Go down this list. So just, just check things off, because this is an actual checklist. So, our boss... Uh, so, uh, skip the bosses for a moment. Uh, Dream Nail, we've got all of them. Nail, or we don't. The Nail Arts, we do. Charms, we have all of them. <laughs> Bosses, I have to look through. Actually, I think most of the bosses are at the bottom, I think. Wow. What the fuck? No, thank you. You gotta. You can't click on that. You can't click on those. You gotta. Like, you have. Each of these is a link. You have to click on only the box and nothing else. We should have all the equipment. <clears throat> so we have the Mothwing Cloak. We've got the... But well, we got the Shape Cloak, which is actually the upgrade to the Mothwing Cloak. So we got both those. We got the Mantis Claw. We got the Crystal Heart. We got Isthmus Tear somewhere in here. There it is. We got the King's Brand, which is that one. And we got the Monarch Wings. So, yeah, we got both those. And then we have the spells, because we currently have Descending Dark Shade Soul and Abyss Shriek, which are the final versions. Mass Shards, we have all the Mass Shards. Vessel Fragments, we have all these. Colosseum, we have all of them. Dreamers. Here's the ones that I wanted to make sure that we have all of. We have Zero. We have Gorb. We have Elder Hugh. Just hit 
forward. No, no forward. Forward. What the hell did you... Now we've lost the whole checklist. Great. Now we have to do it all again. Elder Hugh, we have Marmor, we have No Eyes, we have Galia, we have Marco. We do not have Nightmare King Grim because I haven't fought him yet. We have the three Watchers. We have found Gato. We have. No, let's find all these. We have fought. Both Hornets. We fought the Hive Knight. We fought the Grusmother. We fought Grim the first time. We fought the Dung Defend. We fought the Collector. We fought the Brooding Moloch. We fought the Broken Vessel. We fought Nos. We fought the Manslord. We fought the Soul Master. We fought the Traitor. We fought Umu. We fought the Watcher Knight. I believe. Watcher Knight. We fought the Watcher Knight. We fought the False Knight, which was the first one. Did you stop, please? No, you really just don't want to do that. Fine, I'll use this button. Because the False Knight is the first one. There it is. So yeah, we got all those. So we should have 103, which I believe is the actual number we have. That means that the only percentages left are the nails... Grim and the Pantheon. Okay, so this is easy. Okay. That actually means so that means this boss, the dead boss that I that I put as dead, isn't actually required. Hmm. So he's just he's optional <clears throat> to get more soul, basically. So Okay. Given that revelation that we are at the literal actual end and that there's uh, not much left to do. Let's do this. Why on Uh City Storms. That's probably gonna be the fastest. I probably should have done this in a different order. But I should have like um uh Yeah, I don't know. He's coming for me. Getting the nail upgrades. Yeah, we're going for nail upgrades. Because with the nail upgrades, I will... Wait. With the nail upgrades, I will already have more than 106%. I'll actually have 107%. Are you still going to attempt the bosses? Oh yeah, absolutely. This is the wrong direction. Get out of my way. I think there's a bat down here that's very... Badly placed. I believe I remember this. Thank you. I think it might have been in there. Oh, actually, I'll take that. Yeah, if you would have died, you would have had to walk all the way back. Yeah. For safety, you know. <clears throat> Can't crush you. Oh, 
don't think I, I've actually never gotten the full cutscene of this either. Ah, uh, Ranjo Senja. Mm, oh, you've returned. If you like, I can reforge an air that'll make the blade more deadly. Yeah, I've got infinite money. As you wish, I'll get to work. It is now longer. There we go, the reforging's complete. I've owned your nail's edge. You'll find it much stronger. Head out there and test it. It's mm, more effective against still here. female bugs. Ah, I see you have Perlor, a fine, rare metal. That, give me the ore and some geo for my efforts. I'll reforge it to make it stronger. Next. I guess I should probably show Don't off shy. what the nail looks like. Um, Gardel Akari. I've added a channel to your blade. So if we go in here now, it looks like that. Hmm. You're then still here? Lot. You have Pelo. 2,000. As you wish. <clears throat> so, Gardel Akari. The origin's complete. You have a spiral now. That looks like that. Hmm. They're then still here. I'm not sure if we're gonna have enough for all the new There's no more. Oh. It is done. Curry. Your nail is much stronger. As strong as it could ever be. In only your weapon have I seen such potential. Finally I behold the majesty of the pure nail. To think this moment has come upon me so soon. I, I must step outside a moment. The pure nail. Ah, Ranjo Senja. It was a pure nail forged. My work in this lifetime comes to an end. My only remaining desire is to see and feel the nail strike true. I beg you, cut me down. As my final moment in life, I want to taste the blade's exquisite edge. After all this time, all this toil, haven't I earned it? You can't even. Purity. That's so fucked up. Yeah. His <clears throat> one desire in life is to die to his own creation. Oh yeah, and uh, dead. Oh, I could imagine this nail is just a beast. So, um, what you attempt him first? Give me a second. Dead. Please stand still. Two hits. Actually. Okay. First, I'm going to go back all the way up and get to the, uh, so much easier, um, and get to the, uh, uh, stack station. Thank you. Die again. Ow. I'm guessing they're all for two. Yep. Yep. Oh yeah, they're all they're all two. <coughs> I mean, not everything's two, but these guys are. Please get out of my way. You are just wasting your life. Okay, heal up. Okay, so now let's let's show some difference. So once again, I'm gonna sit back down. I'm gonna take off all this crap. Put on. Deal extra damage with nail. Longer range. And high pool. Probably unnecessary, but. <clears throat> right, also, let's, too. Let's pray that this nail is enough. Well, regardless of if it's enough, it's what we got.
There is nowhere left to go. So, so I'm guessing hit the armor with a nail and then soul it to death when it pops One. out. That's my hope. Can you go up high now? Wake up. I'm only gonna try this a couple times. I'm not guaranteeing I'm fighting this. <clears throat> That's four. So yeah, 11 hits seems a lot better. Eleven hits is doable. As opposed to what I think was actually 33 hits. One. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's nothing with the soul, with the nail upgrade. Without the nail upgrade, it is borderline impossible. I wanted the streak to protect others. When I saw that knight sleeping safe in his big armored shell, <coughs> it was not madness that drove me to it. I just wanted it. But in the end, if the strength cannot save you, then what can? Then what can? Wow. That was what Yeah, it's nothing. That's the point. Is it is only a difficult fight if you are if you have no nail upgrades. If you have nail upgrades, it's nothing. Absolutely nothing. But the the moment you say, mm, I don't want nail upgrades, it's like, well, fuck you. You can't fight. Me. <coughs> so Just... um <coughs> how you think Grim will be Honestly, <laughs> Grim's probably gonna be harder. Because I think Grim is one of the. The Grim and the Pantheon are, I think, some of the bosses that take uh, less. or have more health with the nail. <laughs> I'm not certain. I wonder if it'll matter since the nail is this good. Well, I am still gonna upgrade my soul stuff. So, it'll matter. Yeah, that's that's what I'm saying when I'm just like that. That is not fair. Just it is a brutally impossible fight, and then it's a completely free fight. <laughs> Give me full soul, please. Oh right, forgot. I have to have this guy, who is two. Which means I cannot reduce the cost of casting spells. <laughs> On, the funny thing is, at this point, I don't have to fight Grim. I could choose to, like, get rid of the the troop, and that would also give me the percentage. Huh. I just want to fight Grim. So I'm doing it. But I don't know <clears throat> if I'm going to beat him, but... Yeah, I'd say if you don't beat him, maybe you should make him disappear. No. That's the thing, is I would rather... I would rather... No, like, I would rather not get the percentage than knock him away. It's like, this fight's required. This fight is basically another Radiance fight. Still don't know how to fight that. Like, that's, that's the problem here, is I just, 
fundamentally don't understand how to fight these guys. Like, at all. Like, I jumped and was in his way. That's why I'm like, where do you go? <coughs> like, what is the steps you take to fight this guy? I wonder if Grim's in the Pantheon. Oh, he is. Everything's in the Pantheon. Every single thing. You, the Pantheon is everything's refight. So there is... I don't think there's a Nightmare King Grim refight, but there is a Grim refight, I believe. I dodged that. Yeah, if you can stay on the screen for long enough, maybe you can run and attack me. That's the hope. The fire is the thing that's... Yeah. That's the problem, is I don't... I don't know where to go. It's like, I... Even... I'm, I'm not overcharmed right now. And I still cannot stay alive long enough to figure out his pattern. I don't see any safe places at all anywhere in this fight. Like, where the hell was I supposed to go there? Where the hell was I supposed to go there? I guess you just double jump it. <laughs> when I need to be more central. Yeah, that when, one, I have no clue. At all. I think when he does that attack, you shouldn't have tried to attack him. But that's the problem. Every one of these attacks is a don't attack him attack. So it's like, you have to attack somewhere. He doesn't give any other attacks. This isn't like a just wait it out and eventually he'll give you a favorable attack. There's, they're all unfavorable attacks. So I'm just like, noticing that dash attack is the worst one. Well, yeah, but the problem is, it's it isn't helpful for me to just say, "Well, don't try to attack him." I'm not trying to attack him. I'm trying not to die, and I'm failing at that. Let alone, like, it's so like right there. I'm not trying to hit him there. I'm using the pogo to try to dodge the attack. Yeah, I'm, yeah. So that, it's like you need to do that. Yeah, but unlike that one right there, again, I'm not trying to hit him. I'm trying not to get hit. And I'm saying, I don't know how you do that. That's a new one. Like, I fundamentally don't understand how to dodge that. I don't understand how to dodge either of those attacks. The fire attack, it in the in the original fight, you could pogo him. In this fight, he leaves fire. You can't pogo him. And you can't stay in the air long enough for the fire to dissipate, so where the fuck do they want you to go? I think they want you to stay on the ground. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. He then immediately does an, a dash toward you. Like, I... And that's when you get to the opposite side of it. Right. What do you mean the opposite? That... You're not understanding. He turns and attacks in whatever direction you actively are from him. There is no opposite side. Like, if I'm on the left side, he dashes left. If I'm on the right side, he dashes right. There is no other side. Like, it's... He reacts to where you are. So I can't do that. That's impossible. That's, that's what I'm saying. It's like, I don't understand what this game wants from me. I've watched people do this fight. But, like, watching a walk through this game is unhelpful. It, like, in other games, it's just like, oh, yeah, like, the walkthrough's very helpful because it's just like, oh, go to this place, do this thing. <clears throat> you can't do that for this game. Because, like, there is no way for you to see what they're doing. Like, I've never seen him dash the opposite way. Ever. That is the first time I've ever seen him dash. Yeah, as soon as he dashes down, um, that's the direction he's gonna dash. So, what do you mean as soon as he dashes down? <coughs> like, as soon as he's on the ground facing towards you, that's the direction he's gonna dash towards. Yes, I can agree to that, but there isn't enough time to react to that. 
Like, by the time he starts dashing, there is no time for you to turn around and, like, dash through him or dash the other direction. You're just already, you've already been hit. Let alone you're about to be hit, you've been hit already. Like, yeah, I don't know what he's going to say. Like, this one, I at least understand what I'm supposed to do. But, like, it's you're supposed to wait for the first one. Yeah, like that one, I... That one, you just literally can't hit him at all. No. You can't even go towards him at all. And, and that's the fundamental problem with this fight. I don't... That's a good way to say this. A good fight always allows you to retaliate. In in an optimal fight for any boss ever, you should always be able to retaliate against every single action the boss does. Like, how the fuck am I supposed to know what you're doing? Like, I can retaliate that. You can't retaliate this. No. That's what I'm saying. That's a... If, if there... If you can't retaliate against an action, to me, that is a problem. Especially in a Souls-like game. Like, that's the core thing with these boss fights, is, like, punish the boss for his actions. And I just don't understand how to punish him for any of this shit. The only one I can reasonably punish him for is just the one where he stands there and does fire, but you don't have much time to do that. Like that, there is one second. Fucking hell. Every, okay, this attack pisses me off. Like this actually pisses me off. Every time I try to go to a place I think is safe and it's never safe. I don't understand where safety is. Like, I, I, I'm literally struggling to figure out where is safe whenever he does that attack. Like, <clears throat> this seems like a speedrun boss fight. It's not. Honestly, the, the, the most annoying thing about this boss is just the fact that you can't have all your charms because you have to wear this shitty ch kid charm to get him to even be fightable. He just will not allow you to fight him without the Grim Child on. And it's like, fuck you. Just accept the Grim Child and, like, let me fight you. Okay, that's retaliation. Starting to look like a boss fight we can't do. Yeah. <clears throat> God, even with the nail upgrade. That's the thing. This boss fight isn't about the nail upgrade. The only boss fight in this game that the nail upgrade is really required for is the one we just did. That's it. Every other boss fight isn't really designed for the nail upgrade. 
Like, not that you can't do it. You can. But it's... That's the only boss fight that you have to do it. These boss fights are completely, uh, like, able to be done with enemies. Like, so many of his attacks are dashes that my brain just says, he appears, jump. Because that's more safe than not jumping. My brain, like, cannot... It is, like, my brain is incapable of not pressing the jump button when he spawns. Every single time. Unless he spawns not on the ground. I, I actually don't know what happened there. Like, the jump seemed to just not work correctly. Like that one, because he was in the air. I should just not. I should just not jump. It's weird to say. I think his hitbox is too small. Not not that I think it's incorrect for his model. I think his model is too small. In the sense that what I'm trying to do each time with most other bosses in this game, when I jump and swipe down, I can hit them. With this boss uniquely, I can't do that. So it just feels wrong to fight. By the way, I think I finally figured out the timing. Right there. there we go. So it's like I literally have to hold directly down. Oh yeah, he can uh, make it. Oh, you just really want me to practice. Okay, I'll practice. I'll practice it. I swung at that one. Come on, game. Robbed. That was too late. Nope. I'm guessing he has more than one phase, too. Oh, yeah. he has like three phases. Nope. Too late. this from last time. That was good. Best attempt. Yeah, that was good. <clears throat> I'm getting in the I'm getting in the hang of it. I'm getting there. This boss fight is weird because I feel like I simultaneously have to speed up and slow down. Like I have to react faster, but also react slower. No. 
stop the attack I thought he was doing there. That's the attack I thought he was doing there. Now I'm doing this on the wrong side, so... Yeah, that's gonna happen. That is probably just long enough for me to get one hit. spot. Yeah. Being in the corner is really bad, because when he does that attack, if he dashes, like, if he tries to uh, strike you and then go up, uh, that is just not good to be in a corner. Because you have absolutely no idea where the hell he, the, the safe spot is on that. That is not a good spot. Not yet confident enough in this boss fight to try to heal in that face, and I really should try. Every time. Just one. eventually does. It's just not always the first thing he does. I should have stayed on the ground. That was a bad time to try that. That was a good time to try that. See? So he does actually strike the other way. Wow, he doubled it. Wow, I was not expecting that. But yeah, he definitely... He can definitely switch up which direction, but it's... You're right. Once he turns, like once he's in that direction, he doesn't change. But the set time is so quick after or before the dodge that it's like... It doesn't feel like you have reaction time. I'm definitely not at the place, or even close to the place, where I could overturn this. But I now feel that this could be overturned, just not by me. Come on, game. Should try to heal there. Also, yeah, his boss needs to be slightly bigger. It's it's <clears throat> which is weird to say. Come on, because it looks like you're hitting. Yeah. I mean, one health to heal. Ooh, you should have got hit. Like, he ducks. The, the main thing is he ducks. Them. Nope. That, was the, that is the only attack that he could have done that would not have let that heal work. Healed late. See, now I don't feel it's impossible. Now I feel sloppy. Which I was... It was sloppy before, but... Come on, Graham. I need to stop double jumping. In that specific one, it is. 
Because if you want to, if you want to damage him in that attack, you have to jump one single time and then hold down. If you double jump, you will not be able to. Wouldn't have uh, gotten me much to do the. Sucked. Shit, twice in a row. <clears throat> this phase three, yeah. Uh, I think he does this three times. But it has been a long time since I saw speedrunners fight this guy, so I couldn't actually tell him. No. Take it. Yeah. I'm still at one hit. Yeah, I jumped into him. My fault. My fault. Didn't mean to jump. Jumped anyways. <clears throat> I mean, I slightly meant to jump, but not that high. I was meaning just to go up, swing, and hit him. And then, uh, up attack, and I jumped too high. My fault. Getting there, though. Hold down. I saw you swipe. Yeah, the swipe was correct. It's 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 not that I'm not swiping. It's that in order to hit him when he ducks like that, you have to. I should have done that. Uh, you have to have. That was the worst attack. Yeah. Sorry, my brain can't work with this. Um, this boss fight is taking too much of my mental capacities to talk. Um, to the point that it's, okay, yeah, it's not that you, it's not that I'm not swinging. It's that in order to damage him in that, you, he ducks. So his normal hitbox is hittable, but his ducked hitbox is not. In order to hit him, you have to jump one single time and hold down and then swipe down. Because if you just jump, if you do a full jump and don't hold down and swipe down, you're too high. So in order to punish him in that phase specifically, you have to hold down the whole time and then you can pogo him. And also the fire has to not be coming in the, the exact wrong direction. One, two, three, four. I got the the damage in, but at what cost? Oh, that sucks. That was the worst time. side which I don't like yeah I, I can't do right side I don't know why my brain just can't do the jump script I was I was standing in a spike and didn't press left or right 
Come on, me. Just, just move. Don't fucking stand there. God damn. What? Ain't up going to help. It's just gonna make you sadder. This fight is brutal. Uh, there's a phase that you can kind of cheat. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. There might be a phase that can be cheated, but I don't know if I can cheat. <laughs> Yeah, you can. It's not that I don't know you can hit him there, like right here. It's that in most situations, except for that exact time right there, I've always been trying to heal. Yeah. So the good news is, uh, if you hit him enough times, there's no really other favors. You are kind of near the end. You no, just I need to keep hitting him. Well, yeah. I mean, it's a boss fight, but I, I don't know. That second, um, so this second one, you can dash under and hit him. Oh, interesting. Fucked up. That was the... Yeah, yeah, dash under that second yeah, yeah. one. I vaguely knew you could do that. That one. Yeah. Fucked up. Testing out new stuff doesn't Yeah, me. I firmly believe you can beat this boss. Just I don't think I could overcharm it, but I can definitely yeah. beat this boss. That's that's the thing. The reason I overcharmed everything else in this game was because I had done it once and knew I could do better. I have never fought this guy. Ever. Because I never beat Grim, let alone Nightmare King Grim. The so. guy I'm watching doesn't... He prioritizes the nail. He doesn't really yeah. do treats. Yeah. Which I think is a, a fundamental mistake. Like, treats are high damage. And he doesn't seem to... That was a double hit. Wow. He doesn't seem to pogo... Um, yeah when he does that dash attack. I know. Again, I, I'm i fighting, I'm trying to fight very optimally, which is probably not good for me. Okay, you know when he normally charges at you? You can dash under that and get behind him. And, you, and you won't take damage. Why did I jump in? So not this attack, but the other one, that one. Yeah. That version of that attack, but Yeah, he just hits him with the nail in that place. Yeah. Yeah. Ow. One, two, three, four. Oh. I can heal that. Good to heal that. One, two, three, four. There you go. <clears throat> I got three. I should not have been able to get three. I'm on the wrong side. Can't believe I didn't take any shot. God damn it. One, two, three, four. Fuck. Heal. That. Whoa! Yeah. 
That's, yeah! that's what I'm saying. You can parry through damage sometimes, but it is not common, and it is pure luck. So, pure luck. Yeah, got punished for that. Damn it. I didn't. I didn't oh yeah, my. Once I get. Here's the thing. I am not great at adapting. When. That's. I find a, a method that works and I use it over and over again. So. That's why my brain doesn't think. Oh. Yes, in this one, I am low health. I should just double jump over it and not try to hit it. My brain says, he's in this attack, do this reaction. And that's the only thing my brain lets me do. Yeah, it looks like the nail might do more damage than straight. I mean, it could. But I think that's, that's the, why he's not using soul. The other thing is <laughs> that uh, it depends on your charm loadout. I probably don't have a charm loadout for that. Because I prioritize soul damage. So my charm loadout improves my soul. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I should not have done that. So. Yes! Still gotta hit him. Yeah, this attack, he just nailed him. But oh, you nailed entry, then that might be a good idea too. Yeah, I don't know what the best attack is, but I kind of don't care. And the only reason I nailed and tricked him was because I need I didn't have myself to uh, trick. I didn't jump. In. The, the first one goes, uh, what was I doing? The first one goes up after a while, so, uh, Take it. there's, there's a minimal time to react. Um, uh, the first one goes up after a while, so you can dash under it, sort of. You are on the verge of beating it. Finally jumped over that. Dang it. Ow. Thank you. Oh, that's so I can 30. Completely missed that. Dead. Dead. Woo! <sighs> Fuck you, Grim. Oh, that's good. Immediately safe. Oh yeah, of course. Woo! Ritual. Fuck the ritual. Oh yeah. Uh, now it's gone. He's still here. 
but you can see. He is upgraded. Yeah. <sighs> She's still here, but the main troop gone. Okay, so you've beaten both the knight and Grim. Yeah. So we coming back for the uh all the other boss fights. Oh yeah, I'm going to I'm going to do at least one uh at least <clears throat> one run through where I attempt to do the pantheon. And I'll attempt to do the some of the pantheon. Oh, I can remove this one now. Uh and did I remove? I didn't remove that one, so I can remove that one too. I'm gonna attempt to do the Pantheon. At least a, there are four Pantheons. Well, I think there's only more than four Pantheons. There's four main Pantheons, the ones that actually give you percentage. I'm gonna try to do them <laughs> overcharmed a couple times, and if that does not seem possible, I will do it under charmed. Well, I'll do it charmed right. And, uh, yeah, we'll play around with that. But, yeah. after uh, We are now at the point, guys, where we are... I'm going above and beyond the goals. Because we are at 108%. So we are 2% over the amount that I set just because I was like, okay, I don't know if I can get higher. So, at this point, when I decide we are done, we are done. So that may be one, two streams. Don't know. Won't be much longer. Depends on if all the bro thinks he can get through Pantheon. Yeah. Okay, guys, that was going to be it for today's episode. So, like and subscribe to YouTube and Twitch. Comment to your videos if you read them. Follow on Twitch, and we'll see you guys in the next Hollow Night. Goodbye. Good night, everyone. Hello, Mr. B. Goodbye, you, Mr. B. B.